Hi everyone, welcome back, and I just want to let you guys know if you want to have a better lifestyle or make that little extra income or a mix of both, go in, go look in the description below in the first chunk, uh, the link, and there are some steps for you to follow to hopefully help you guys out, etc. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments and. I just want to get right into this video, and this one is called Kids in the Dark. Growing up poor in a deep south meant sharing lots with my brother, my little brother, Ollie. Most often, we'd pass toys, clothes, and skin conditions between us. Up until he was six, we sh even shared a bed. Neither of us was happy about that. It was my 10th birthday when I, when that changed. I got a present, one, I got one present that year, and it was my own bed. Ollie was jealous right away. I couldn't understand why. He had to keep, ha keep that half broken frame with the worn out mattress. The one I've gotten much better, but not broken worn was enough. Sleeping apart was a great feeling. It was freedom. No longer, no longer would I have to suffer the sudden and in, uh, inexplainable kicks to my stomach. No longer have to wake up all, all these foot pressed into my neck like he stopped, stepped on Dracula that night before. At least that's what I thought. Right af right away after I got a new bed, the sh Shrek started. At first, I thought Ollie woke up in the middle of the night screaming because he was scared. Then the second echo through the tiny room again. I knew it wasn't normal crying. The room was always pitch black after sunset. The window had we had pressed against a long leaf pine, even the biggest brightness moon, no cast light aside. The sh shriek Shrek was about grow crazy, even probably at the same exact time, and sharp yelps would knock me over uh, out of my dream. But it wasn't mom or dad yelling either. I knew that was sounded like I believe, believe me. Most worry of all, the fact would never tell when it was coming from. Coming from, it was seemed completely random. One night, it come over somewhere near the closet. That the next, it shoot from the corner of the ceiling. Any hope I'd had of having in many space and dashed every time as Ollie would slightly slip into the bed with me, shaking like crazy. He collapsed onto me and wouldn't let go until almost daybreak. Most times it take his hand to tell him everything's going to be okay. That it'll be over by the morning. I was really sh but I was never really sure. Over the time, the shrieks started changing. At first, it was the small degree, but eventually it took primal hooting, sound, hooting sounds of priming calling the calling out of the forest warning. I had collapsed pillows to my ears just to keep going to prevent getting getting from de being deaf. Mom and I would never believe me or Ollie basically because the thing. However, it was refused to make a peep when they were in the room. Apparently, they couldn't even hear through the walls even though it was damaged sure loud enough. The shriek uh, just got worse and worse until I felt like I couldn't take it anymore. Me and Ollie were doing really bad in school. 
We just had no energy at all. I couldn't sleep more deeply with my head propped up in eyes in the middle of class in the room at night. Even thankfully, we moved out of the house nearly a year later. I continued, I, I had compl uh, of short things, even as a clumsy child, attempt of, of suic suicide and got away from a horror noisy n nightly noise. There was no problem in the next next house. It was white cookie corner home on a dead street and welcomed and I welcomed the normalcy. Uh what's the more when we move there was a bunk bed waiting for me and Ollie. No more broken bed. No more second bed. I ended up having to sh having to share anyway. I, the only problem was who would be getting the top bunk. I told Ollie I deserved it. After all, I had gotten a new bed back way, but he ruined by climbing every night. What? He shook his head. I never did that. I always wondered why the noise stopped the second I was sharing my bed. Now, I had the answer. Let me know what your guys' thoughts, if maybe if you're the parent and your child's children or child are telling you this, or if you're the ch child or children and you're telling your parents this, let me know what your guys' thoughts and opinion on that story. And I will see you t in, uh, tomorrow in tomorrow's video. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.